What is up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. We back with the part two. We got Danny Lee back in the click, and we also got bum ass. Ooh! little baby in the click now y'all know i had to get a little extra with it i love the baby musically but he showed another side that i really dislike anyways y'all if y'all haven't seen my last video go check it out but we got summer walker in the click today you guys because summer walker just opened up my heart made me feel much better about the situation and she made a post in her stories saying d word n word really ain't ish being ish like that really make my chest hurt brings a b flashback hashtag still over it i love that album i'ma pray for her and then she at danny lee and said no cap whatever you need hit me and i mean whatever now i love exactly what she did because she just gave an example of how women and mothers need to stick together through situations like this especially the fact that danny lee just had a baby three months ago postpartum is most definitely real and who else but summer walker knows what she's going through no shade but we all know what she went through when she was with london on the track with the baby mother debacle but we love summer walker that was beautiful moving right along let's talk about how danny lee cousin stepped into the click and he wrote move in silence keep my family out your mouth and in that gangster at the baby now i laughed when i seen it because i'm like let me tell you something this is super weird how you just come out of nowhere trying to insert yourself into this beef because it's on every blog and you're an artist in dominican republic i don't know if it's in dominican republic or you just dominican but we don't even care the point of the matter is we didn't see how you fight but we know the baby that knocked out a couple people so he's not the USSY. so when you're calling him an internet gangster that was pretty funny because clearly you don't know the baby and honestly speaking i feel like this was definitely a cloud chasing thing because to call out the baby if you was a real family member you would hit him up in private anywho moving right along the baby made a video in his stories and had a couple things to say and get off his chest he even revealed their baby y'all take a look y'all remember whatever come with it and come with it daddy first celebrity after if all that bullshit y'all was hearing was what it was my baby wouldn't be right here on my arms Cool. Yeah, I'll take care of them kids, but I'm gonna take care of my kids. Oh. And the shouty family is trying to chime in and, and speak on the situation. Y'all don't even know her. She don't know y'all either. She ain't never seen y'all a day in the life. Shorty mama, you ain't even met your grandbaby yet. Shortly after that video, Danny was like, sad that's how y'all had to see my baby for the first time, his evil amen. I believe that he was trying to be vindictive because she clearly was not wanting to show her child. She would have been showing her. But let's get to the point that he wrote that her family disowned their half black grandbaby because they couldn't control their daughter. Now, part of me do believe that because at one point, I don't know if y'all remember, Danny Lee fired her team at one point because she was having a relationship with her mom and they exposed her saying that her mom was fake and they never had a relationship and all of a sudden Danny Lee is making money now her mom wants to be back in the picture and telling her that everyone is trying to use her now there got to be some type of truth towards that I'm gonna go and see if I could find that and if I find it I'm definitely gonna make a video so y'all could see that there was something going on and also the baby definitely exposed that she was going through something when they went to the Dominican Republic so I'll see if I can find that video and make another video anyways you guys I pray that nothing but goodness come out of this situation and that they really don't drag this situation because that baby like I said in my last video needs two level-headed parents and the back and forth and the bickering and the childish stuff gotta stop it is okay to co-parent anywho you guys I'll see you guys in the next video let's continue to pray for Danny Lee and hope that this situation gets better for her I'll see you guys in the next video Step into the